Sofian. Don't me for the way I look. I'm from a very, very tedious journey right now. Hello guys, good afternoon and welcome back. So I, as you can see, I have my hiking shoes on. When you know, when you see me with these shoes, know there's something mighty for me to mount. Yeah. So um, right now we are at Mount Mark and Nyabang. Um, I don't know anything about this mountain. I've never heard about it, but I know it's an amazing touristic destination. So I booked on it online through Young Africa, and right here I am with my guide, Monsieur. <laughs> With my guide right here, um, Hello. yes. So he's going to be helping me hike Mount Nyabang and Mount Nyabang, right? Yeah. And we'll discover what the mountain is all about. I know there's something spiritual about this mountain, and I'm here to discover it. And as usual, I'm taking you guys along every step of the way. So let's discover together. Okay. Don't the point. Step right. All right, Jesus, All right. Are you ready? All right. Please do not forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Just hit the like and subscribe button right now as we hike Mount Nyabang. All right, guys. See you soon. Ah, let me not come out here with one eye. Oh. I beg because the sticks. This is the stress we have to go through to bring you guys content. You get Cameroon has so much potential when it comes to tourism, but the only problem is accessibility. Accessibility to these sites is kind of like a, a problem. But <laughs> well, if the government doesn't want to do something about it, we the locals are going to do something about it ourselves. Because getting here was getting here wasn't easy. Like, big. I'll talk to you guys later, big. Ouch! Can't go see a way long trouser. It's not there. Ouch. Ah, look at this view. Why don't do anything right now, yeah? What's the problem? Wow. That's the problem. The thing about this mountain is, it's not like it's one serious hiking. Eh? It's, a, it's a very serious hiking, but there are so many obstacles. Oh, like finding this man inside my shirt. That's the thing. Uh, it's a really beautiful hike with so much beautiful views and um, really refreshing. The problem is passing through these woods and everything. But up here, it's a little bit open and the views are mad. The views are mad, man. The views are mad. Like, it's really beautiful. Samash? C'est pas facile. J'ai envie d'abandonner, mais bon, on doit faire avec. Ça va arriver au sommet. Many people say climbing is not the most difficult part. Going down is. I don't know about you, but me, going down is like the most easy part and climbing is like the most difficult part for me. When I hiked Maninguba, going down wasn't easy, I swear. Going down wasn't easy. But thank God this one, it's accessible enough where you can use bike right up to the foot of the mountain and climb just a few meters up to the summit. So we're heading down right now to get to our bikes and head down to the city of Kong Samba. Hey, the city of Kong Samba is clean, very clean. It's pop. We'll go check that out for ourselves, okay? Let's go. Me, Adesu, I'll be very lazy content creator. I accept. So, I'm on this trip with Frank Bikele. Hi, <laughs> this periphery like content. I see, hey, look at where he is right now.
There they are still flying drone. Oh, brother, I'm hungry. I'm dehydrated. All I want right now is some good bush meat and some cold chilled beer. <laughs> I want some good bush meat, porcupine or pangolin, and some cold chilled beer. I know the content again. Tired. Tired. Let's see a pop now. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. You know. You know. So this is natural spring water from the mountain. Super clean. So don't wash my face now, they're a little bit fresh. And all dust to come off my skin. At least I'm gonna go find chop chop since morning. I haven't eaten anything. So yeah. So right now we are at the city of Nkong Samba, the central town. You can see they have their own uh, Jean Montpellier. We are heading now to look for food to eat and uh, our guide took us to this place known as Monday Restaurant. If you're in Kong Samba and you don't know Monday, my brother, you're on a long thing. Thank you for paying. It's a beautiful day. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a beautiful day. Yeah. Don't pull a moment on par. Dans le snack bar de Didi et Yango. Didi et Yango. Montagna. Montagna. Yeah. So, you know, Didi et Yango is a native of Kong Samba and he's a legend. His snack bar carries a lot of force and a lot of tourists attractions for the people of Consemba. So we're going there to check it out and see what he has to offer. Exactly. So yeah, let's go. Bienvenue en Kong Samba. I love my town, Kong Samba. Clean town. Hello. The idea is very beautiful. It's not block, it's not cement, it's um, <laughs> steel. <laughs> Uh, anyway, it's a very nice idea. So we are here at Kong Samba now. We're visiting um, Dedi Eyangu snack bar known as La, La Montagna. Thank you. 